merciful and compassionate Father. We confess our sins and we humbly come to you to find forgiveness and life. We come to you in our need to seek your protection against the COVID-19 virus that has disturbed and claimed many lives. We ask you now to look upon us with love and by your healing hand, dispel the fear of sickness and death, restore our hope, and strengthen our faith. We pray that you guide the people tasked to find cures for this disease and to stem its transmission. Bless our efforts to use the medicines developed to end the pandemic in our country. We pray for our health workers that they may minister to the sick with competence and compassion. Grant them health and mind and body, strength in their commitment, protection from the disease. We pray for those afflicted. May they be restored to health. Protect those who care for them. Grant eternal rest to those who have died. Give us the grace in these trying times to work for the good of all and to help those in need. May our concern and compassion for each other see us through this crisis and lead us to conversion and holiness. Grant all these through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. Amen. We fly to your protection, O Holy Mother of God. Do not despise our petition in our necessities, but deliver us always from all dangers. O glorious and blessed Virgin, Amen. Our Lady, Health of the Sick, pray for us. Saint Joseph, pray for us. Saint Raphael the Archangel, pray for us. San Roque, pray for us. San Lorenzo Ruiz, pray for us. San Pedro Calungsod, pray for us. We are gathered in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The grace and peace of God our Father, the love of our Lord Jesus Christ, and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with you all. And with your spirit. Today we celebrate the memorial of St. Cyril, a monk, and St. Methodius, a bishop. They are brothers, and they are both holy men, also known as the co-patron of Europe and the patron of the Slavic people. And we ask that we, like Cyril and uh, Methodius, be able to share our sibling or brotherly love, sisterly love to one another as we celebrate Valentine's Day. So, my dear brothers and sisters, to prepare ourselves to celebrate this Eucharist, we call to mind our sins, and we ask the Lord for pardon and strength. You were sent to heal the contrite of heart. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. You came to call sinners. 
Christ have mercy. Christ have mercy. You are now seated at the right hand of God to intercede for us. Lord have mercy. Lord have mercy. May Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. Let us pray. O God, who enlightened the Slavic peoples through the brothers Saints Cyril and Methodius, grant that our hearts may grasp the words of your teaching and perfect us as a people of one accord in true faith and right confession. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. Amen. A reading from the beginning of the letter of St. James. James, a servant of God and of the Lord Jesus Christ, to the twelve tribes in the dispersion, greetings. Consider it all joy, my brothers and sisters, when you encounter various trials, for you know that the testing of your faith produces perseverance. And let perseverance be perfect, so that you may be perfect and complete, lacking in nothing. But if any of you lacks wisdom, he should ask God, who gives to all generously and ungrudgingly, and he will be given it. But he should ask in faith, not doubting, for the one who doubts is like a wave of the sea, and that is driven and tossed about by the wind. For that person must not suppose that he will receive anything from the Lord, since he is a man of two minds, unstable in all his ways. The brother in lowly circumstances should take pride in high standing, and the rich one in his lowliness, for he will pass away like the flower of the field. For the sun comes up with its scorching heat and dries up the grass, its flower droops, and the beauty of its appearance vanishes. So will the rich person fade away in the midst of his pursuits. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Be kind to me, O Lord, and I shall live. Be kind to me, Lord, and I shall live. Before I was afflicted, I went astray, but now I hold to your promise. Be kind to me, Lord, and I shall live. You are good and bountiful. Teach me your statutes. Be kind to me, Lord, and I shall live. It is good for me that I have been afflicted, that I may learn your statutes. Be kind to me, Lord, and I shall live. The law of your mouth is to me more precious than thousands of gold and silver pieces. Be kind to me, Lord, and I shall live. I know, Lord, that your ordinances are just, and in your faithfulness you have afflicted me. Be kind to me, Lord, and I shall live. Let your kindness comfort me according to your promise to your servants. Be kind to me, Lord, and I shall live. Alleluia, alleluia. I am the way and the truth and Lord, the life, says the Lord. No one comes to the Father except through me. Alleluia, alleluia. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. A proclamation from the Holy Gospel according to St. Mark. Glory to you, O Lord. The Pharisees came forward and began to argue with Jesus, seeking from him a sign from heaven to test him. He sighed from the depth of his spirit and said, Why does this generation seek a sign? Amen, I say to you, no sign will be given to this generation. Then he left them, got into the boat again, and went off to the other side. Sisters and brothers, the Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. 
First of all, um, let me just categorically say that there is no such uh, saint as uh, Saint Valentine's. No, uh, it used to be in the list of saints, but was taken out during the Second Vatican Council because it's more mythological rather than he really, uh, you know, existed. So what we are celebrating today is Cyril and Methodius, no? who were. Saint Cyril used to be Constantine, you know, but when he came a monk, he became Cyril. And Methodius was uh, named Michael, and when he became a bishop, uh, he changed his name into Methodius. You know. So, why are these very important? I will share with you later. Because the gospel today speaks of signs. You know, this generation, Jesus is frustrated, no? Because the people, especially the Pharisees, were looking for signs. No? But what are signs? No? Today, we celebrate Valentine's and we have lots of signs. First sign is heart, no? Here, we have it. Second sign, balloons, diba? You give balloons. Those are signs that signify love. Also chocolates, also roses, no? So, so many signs. And sometimes, you know, if there's someone who we truly love, no, tatampo tayo, no? We feel bad if we were not remembered by these signs. And I think if Jesus were here, he would also have been frustrated because people are so concerned about signs, buying all things, no? But the more important sign is radical love. Or I should say, love. No? And it's not a sign only. A symbol. You know, signs, what is the difference between a sign and a symbol? No? A sign is something that signifies uh, a reality. It points to it. But once it is able to point to that reality, it disappears, it degenerates. For example, if someone gives you a rose, pag nalanta na yung rose, wala na yung value. Kasi sign lang yon ng love. But a symbol like the cross of Jesus, no? after pointing us to Jesus himself, retains its value. And it guides us. no? And that is what Jesus is saying. We look for signs, no? There are so many signs, no? But let us transform these signs into symbols. They signify love, but we need the symbol of love. You know, my dear brothers and sisters, you know, if you are looking around, no? Symbols are not only positive, no? Symbols are also negative. And there is so much evil around us. No? Let us open our eyes and let us see this and make a stand for truth, for freedom, for responsibility and accountability, for knowledge, for righteousness. For these are not only signs, they are symbols that points to our reality as human persons, the image and likeness of God. So we are all symbols of God. May one who sees you appreciate your real value because you are not only a sign but a symbol of God's love. That's the reason why Saint Cyril has been transformed from Constantine and Methodius have, uh, you know, has, is a name, new name, transformed from Michael because our saints, the sibling love which is taught now becomes not as only a sign but a symbol of love. May each of you be symbols of love this Valentine's Day because you have the capacity to love radically. The name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen.
we now offer our prayers and petitions, especially those for whom we have promised prayers, and let our response be, Lord, hear our prayer. Lord, hear our prayer. That the leaders of the church may work tirelessly in bringing God's message of repentance to those who seek the Lord with a sincere heart, we pray. Lord, Lord hear, hear our, our prayer. prayer. That as sinners, we may come to a deeper realization of the love and mercy which God has for all who turn to Him with a humble and contrite heart, we pray. Lord, Lord hear, hear our, our prayer. prayer. That we may have a deep and true faith in God which is not limited to external signs and appearances, we pray. Lord, Lord hear, hear our, our prayer. prayer. That the sick may realize God's constant love for them, despite their trials and difficulties, we pray. Lord, Lord hear, hear our, our prayer. prayer. That the dead may find peace and happiness in the kingdom of God, we pray. Lord, Lord hear, hear our, our prayer. prayer. We also pray for those celebrating their birthdays, especially Lumentan, Greg Trash, Gabriel Harabata, Joey Lau, Larry Agregado, Sarah Hill Unas, Rochelle Serrano, Inigo Ruiz Torres, Chef Jesse, Celedonio Fungo, Raymond Lim, Luchi Alesna, Colleen Panahon, Father Ted Gonzalez S.J., Juni De La Cruz. Also for the healing of Donnie Salvador, Henry Tan, Alessandra Jade Tan, Aga Camarata, Aina Lacson, Ramon Lucero Mayuga. For the repose of the souls of the following, Edgar Arnaldo, Margaret Jong, Ramon Fernandez, Boy Sering, Maylene Rose Bonza, Alexandria Barairo, Alan Matutina, Lucing Tanedo, Emperatriz Gaston, Grace Sablan. For the special intentions of St. Paul University Philippines to Gegarao, June and Vivian Ayong on their wedding anniversary, Leong and Mia Parada on their wedding anniversary, Lito and Giselle Barairo, and Michael Ocampo. And for all our personal intentions, and all the intentions sent to our Facebook pages at Jescom and Radio Katipunan, we pray. Lord, Lord hear, hear our prayer. prayer. We pray for our nation. We pray for our beloved Philippines, that we may open our eyes to the symbol of truth, freedom, responsibility, righteousness and we may be able to choose the right leaders for our country. Loving Father, we present to you our needs. It is with trust and confidence that we ask them through Christ our Lord. Amen. Blessed are you, Lord God, of all creation, for through your goodness you have this bread and wine given to us, fruit of the earth and work of human hands and of the vine. It will become for us our spiritual food and drink. Blessed be God forever. Pray, my sisters, my brothers, that this our sacrifice, yours and mine, may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of his name, for our good and the good of all his holy church. Look, O Lord, upon the offerings which we bring before your majesty in commemoration of St. Cyril and Methodius, and grant that these gifts may become the sign of a new humanity, reconciled to you in loving charity, through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your heart. We lift them up to the Lord. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is truly right and just, our duty and our salvation, always and everywhere to give you thanks, Lord, Holy Father, 
Almighty and Eternal God. For you are praised in the company of your saints, and in crowning their merits, you crown your own gifts. By their way of life, you offer us an example. By communion with them, you give us companionship. By their intercession, sure support, so that encouraged by so great cloud of witnesses, we may run as victors in the race before us and win with them the imperishable crown of glory through Christ our Lord. And so with the angels and saints, we praise you and the multitude with him of praise as without end we acclaim. Holy, holy, holy Lord, Lord God, God of hosts, heaven, heaven and earth are full of your glory. glory. Hosanna in, in the highest. Blessed, Blessed is he who comes in the name, name of the Lord. Lord. Hosanna, Hosanna in, in the highest. You are indeed holy, O Lord, the fount of all holiness. Make holy, therefore, these gifts, we pray, by sending down your Spirit upon them like the dewfall, that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread and gave you thanks. He broke the bread, gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice and once more giving thanks, gave the chalice to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it, for this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The mystery of faith. When we eat this bread and drink this cup, we proclaim your death, O Lord, until you come again. Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. For humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Lord, remember your church spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity together with our Pope Francis, our Bishop Onesto, and all men and women who serve your church. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection and all have died in your mercy, especially those for whom we now pray. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with Blessed Joseph, her husband, with the Blessed Apostles and all the saints, Saint Cyril and Methodius, who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit to be co-heirs to eternal life and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. For through him, with him, and in him, O God, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Amen. Our Lord Jesus Christ told us that God is the Father, and so we now with courage pray. we pray. Our, Our Father, Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil, and grant us peace in our day, that in your mercy we may be free from sin and from all distress, as we await the blessed hope and coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, you said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and grant the peace and the unity of your kingdom, where you live forever and ever. Amen. The peace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with you always. And with your spirit. We offer one another a sign of Christ's peace. Peace, peace be with you. Peace and love for all. Lamb of God, you, you take, take away, away the sins of the, of the world, world, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, grant us peace. My brothers, my sisters, this is Jesus Christ, love, the symbol of God the Father's love and compassion. 
How blessed are we who are called to receive him. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word and my soul shall be healed. My Jesus, I believe that you are present in the most holy sacrament. I love you above all things, and I desire to receive you into my soul. Since I cannot at this moment receive you sacramentally, come at least spiritually into my heart. I embrace you as if you were already there and unite myself wholly to you. Never permit me to be separated from you. Amen. Amen. May the body and blood of Christ bring us to eternal life. Amen. Let us pray. O God, Father of all nations, who make us sharers in the one bread and the one spirit and heirs of eternal banquet, grant in your kindness on this feast day of St. Cyril and Methodius that the multitude of your children, persevering in the same faith, may be united in building up the kingdom of justice, peace, and love. This we ask through Christ our Lord. Amen. So just a brief announcement and invitation. Tonight we have a recollection here at Radio Katipunan. It's entitled True Love, Fake Love. We will have Father Roby Paraan and Sister Ina Unyate to facilitate our recollection. Please join us at 8.30 in the evening. So, ulitin ko po, no? True love, fake love with Father Roby Paraan, SJ, and Sister Ina Unyate, RC. So, join us at 8.30 here in Radyo Katipunan. Thank you very much. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. May Almighty God bless you and your loved ones, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Our Eucharist has been offered. Transform yourself from signs to symbol of love. Thanks be to God. Sa krus ni Jesus Ang siyang sa mundo'y tumubos Langit at lupa siya'y papurihan Araw at tala siya'y parangalan Ating pag-iwang pag-ibig ng Diyos sa tanan Alleluia At isigaw sa lahat Oh, 